Brazil to Freedom. the Californian fleet. Well, there we have it. Everything all packed up. It's time for us to go to the airport now. We've got one issue. Monia's luggage is all overweight. <laughs> From her hand luggage to, to her luggage luggage. We're in trouble. So we're really hoping that uh, when we get to the airport they're a little bit lenient. Which I don't think they're going to be, but Monia seems to be quite positive. So, <laughs> it's whole thing is crossed. We are overweight. No, you are overweight. <laughs> I was out there alone, moving from station to station. I've been searching for the right one, but I was ready for something more. Finally arrived at our first little apartment in uh, Sao Paulo. Very, very, very nervous as to the safety. You've been running with the wild ones. Good morning, everybody. It is uh, our first day in Sao Paulo. Today we're gonna try and vlog the entire day. So now the time is 521. Uh, Monia is over there. Changing. <laughs> so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go upstairs, we're gonna train. We're gonna take you around with us and see how much we can do in just one day in Sao Paulo. 10 to 8. It's 10 to 8 in the morning. Already. We've, we've already trained, we woke up, we, it wasn't as successful as we had planned. We couldn't find the gym, we couldn't find lights, so we just kind of like did a quick little super circuit and some stretching in the elevator lobby <laughs> but i mean look i feel fresh i feel really great now it's about eight o'clock we're gonna head out we're gonna get some nice breakfast apparently there's some really cool cafes and everything around here and we're gonna go on the hunt to see some street art uh, we're gonna get a sim card today because we don't have uh, data or anything so it's difficult for us to call cabs and to know exactly where we are anya's got a whole bunch of plans i'm just going along with her today Teach my soul to sing your song Even when my eyes can't see Breakfast and coffee first When I can't seem to carry on I know your hand is guiding me I know your hand is guiding me That was about a eight dirhams, which I think is 12 Brazilian real. A little cab ride, which was very, very quick. And now we're at this sick market, which is pretty cool. Just got a whole bunch of everything. Really. So come the storm, I'll still believe. down to eat one of these uh, well I guess they're famous because everybody's <laughs> told us that we need to have these like but a huge look at that. sandwich with a lot of meat and cheese that it looks, looks insane. like a heart attack but yeah. definitely worth it so we're gonna I'm gonna give it a try Monia doesn't eat meat I'm gonna give it a try we're gonna get some coffee um, and then maybe walk around and see what else we can see reaching down Yummy. the guy in the Wow. You're always reaching down to guide me Cause I am yours and I am free Boy. Luckily I woke up this morning and did about 15 squats <laughs> Feeling really lean You are all like Hello, glad to meet you <laughs> Mix your food and chocolate oh. They do strawberry mix. Yes. Thank you. Very good. 
Nature's chocolate, says he. Oh, banana. Mix your fruit, sandwich, do this. Yes. Is a kiwi and a banana? Yes. No. Yes. That is good. The best. Thank you. The best. Wow. This is a kiwi and a banana. Oh, talk about geo farm. Thank you. Thank you. What is this? Rimaya <laughs> Shili. I don't mind the slow down. I don't mind the sound of my shoes on your floor. I don't mind selling out or playing cover song. I don't know what I just ate. <laughs> as long as friends and but that was nice. And I don't need more money or faster car. No. Don't need a magazine to call me a superstar. Lemon, mandarin, and orange. All in one. California. California. Yeah. Who knew you had to come to Brazil to eat a Californian food? It just feels healthy. I feel like I'm getting vitamins. Yeah. Hopefully not Corona. <laughs> Hopefully not Corona. Hmm. Actually, as I said that, as I licked my fingers, probably gonna die. Oh my god! Now we're about to eat some potato-looking things. Thank you. Oh wow. That's a weird one. That's a weird one, huh? That's weird. In the backyard we are going to start a garden. If that don't sound mighty good, I beg your pardon. It's in my heart. Found the SIM card. Yeah, but we don't know if this is like a SIM card for data or if it's SIM card for like local local calls. Yeah, um, so she's trying to help us all, but the language barrier, it's uh, something which is very difficult for us right now. It's real, man. I feel like I really need to learn Portuguese. Okay, you need to register before using, but only at the chip shop. Okay, and where where is the chip shop? Even if we buy one here, we have to still register this. So we can't actually use this now, so we're still hurt. If they don't love us, we don't need them. Well, let's find our own brand of free. Sitting in an Uber, uh, we heard... <laughs> we don't have a SIM card, so we don't know where to go. So we had booked an Uber to like a like a monument thing, but then when we pulled up there, it looked like it was kind of in the middle of nowhere. So we're paying the guy cash to take us somewhere where there's like, you know, a few coffee shops or, you know, walking somewhere distance, somewhere where we can walk around and potentially find a SIM card. So this is quite a big hassle at the moment because without a SIM card, we don't have access to maps, we don't have access to Uber, and it's not safe to walk through some of these streets, so, you know, we don't want to get stranded. People inside there. Pretty funny story. The, the guy brought us to this mall where apparently we can get SIM cards, but it's locked. <laughs> oh man, I'm so glad we left Dubai. <laughs> For the safety and the weather and, you know, <laughs> convenience. We managed to speak to a security guard and uh, the mall only opens at 4 p.m. And now what's the time? <laughs> 10 a.m. It's 10 a.m. So Jesus. Have six hours. I'm usually only waking up at this time. You see why you should sleep in. <laughs> All right, we found a shop that we can get the SIM card at. It's a 35 minute walk. I personally don't believe like this thing is going to continue to connect. But Monia is quite positive about this. Alright, good news and bad news. The good <laughs> news is Monia's navigation technique worked. We didn't need Wi-Fi. So we've stopped here now. Type in the next destination that we want to go to and then we can walk without Wi-Fi. The bad news is that 
the shop for the SIM card was in a mall and the mall is closed until 4 p.m. So we don't have time to be waiting for that. So we're going to now find our next destination, which is to find some good street art. Yes, yeah. and we have a beer now. Yeah. So while we're having a beer, uh, I can find the direction to Via Maddalena, where we can see six street art. And yeah, and we enjoy our beer. Why ride. would you look outside yourself when you have all of the world inside? One, two, three, four. Yeah, your heart is a sun and it shines as it opens. Well, your heart is a sun and it shines as it opens. Yeah, your heart is a sun and it shines. So we made it, we found the street art, and um, we've now just pulled into this little beautiful, beautiful little, we don't know what this is really, it's a little bar. Um, we need to use the Wi Fi, thank you. Cheers. Guys, street art is sick, beautiful. Mm. I enjoyed it. The street art was really cool. We did some cool little photo opportunities. Um, now we've got to use the Wi-Fi because we need to see where our next location is. We're thinking like a cathedral or something. We're going to have a look at how far it is and whether it's uh, plausible. And if we need to order an Uber from here, we'll order an Uber from here. Actually, it all depends if it's going to rain or not because it looks like it may be. But if won't and the cathedral is quite close, we're going to walk to the cathedral because we actually we enjoy walking a lot. I mean, my toes are quite sore. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, speak for yourself. <laughs> It is still, what's the time? Oh my f it's 11 11. 11. Oh shit! <laughs> it was 11 11. <laughs> it's clearly a sign that we were supposed to put out this vlog, and uh, here we are. Traveling idiots. <laughs> I think you have seen the most raw side of us, so it can't get much worse. <laughs> it cannot actually. If you guys enjoyed this vlog, and you want to continue to see more we promise we're going to learn along the way subscribe to the channel hit the like button it would really help us and we also just want to say thank you so much for